is live in the Albany newsroom and he's uh, got the t details for us now. Pat? Yeah, Jerry, that's right. It's called trans shipping, and in a nutshell, it's giving beverage distributors in the state of New York an unfair advantage and taking money out of the state coffers. And because of that, the DEC, the state attorney general, and the Department of Taxation are investigating a handful of distributors in New York State, including here. According to a DEC spokesman, a majority of the trans shipping is going on in the New York City area, but they do say there's at least one instance of it happening in the capital region. Now, according to DEC investigation, beverage distributors are buying cans and bottles of products outside of the state of New York where there is no bottle deposit in certain states and then reselling them here in New York State with that deposit. Now because of that, stores who buy the product are of course paying more for it. The consumer not able to return it so they're paying more and the state is losing out on that tax. Now this morning I talked on the phone with the State Association of Convenience Stores. They represent over 1,500 stores statewide. Now an official there told me this is always a concern. He says, again, we are just talking nickels, but all those nickels add up and over large purchases and those nickels then turn into dollars. So just how much is being taken out of the state coffers? That's one of the big questions. We've asked that question to the State Department of Taxation. I'm continuing to work on this story throughout the afternoon. We plan to hear from state officials a little later on tonight to find out that dollar figure. I'll have much more on this coming up tonight at 530. For now, live in the Albany Newsroom, Pat Bailey, CBS 6 News.